Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Umineko Banquet of the Golden Witch. So last time, the adults concluded that uh, Beatrice's game is real. Frickin' finally! That's a possibility. Oh, hi, young Eva. Time has passed. Ooh, we going back to Purgatorio? Yep.
devil's brutes. Now, unlike some of the somewhat spurious logic that's used in the movie, though, I'd like to note that the Devil's Proof is, in fact, a real-world uh, concept that has a lot of merit to it. Ah, oh, here we go, Hempel's Raven. This is where the logic starts getting really weird. See, while the Devil's Proof has merit in, re in a real-world setting, Hempel's Raven is an amazingly stupid bit of logic that would only work in a competition like this. Beatrice. Yep, show actual proof using the contrapositive. You will see in a second how absolutely ridiculous this idea is. What must you do to prove that ravens are black? Birds that aren't black are not ravens. That is the logic of Compel's Raven. Basically, if X, then Y, then if not X, then not Y. This is an amazingly stupid argument.
logic! It's also one of the worst examples of unbelievably stupid logic in the world. Seriously, I loathe Hempel's Raven. gonna give us To be that TV tropes de uh, describe this entire series as basically bizarro logic chess.
course, she could always say something like, there are no more than 18 humans on the island. So it's more like a treasured uh, flintlock rifle.
Actually, there, later on in the game, there is a thousand other reasons why we have to play this game. One of the most notable ones because it being that you literally cannot speak something untrue in red. Beelzebub. If you guys remember, Beelzebub is gluttony, so... Cookies! God, I want a cookie. So Rose is gonna explain, huh? Just what I needed. Although actually, Rose's explanation here sheds some serious light on some aspects of the plot, so pay attention. Although, I'm not sure I'll be able to get to it fully this time because I'm running out. Got like seven minutes left. What? You know what? Because I'm an asshole, I'm gonna leave on that cliffhanger. See you guys next time. Bye bye